Alright, this is my pirate ship that I built for my son for Halloween 2010. It took about two months to make. It's made out of one by one by one box tubing, Luan plywood, two by fours ripped down for trimming for the uh, casing around the uh, borders. It's uh, it's lightweight, probably weighs about about 35, almost 40 pounds. You see where uh, it has all the windows in the back that light up at night. They're all cut out. We can actually uh, go right through. There's lights inside there. I got the skulls holding them up. On the sides, I got the cannons coming down the sides. Got the anchor in the front being held up by the ropes. Got the sails. Lightweight material. Transparent, sewed to just metal, just like metal coat hangers for reinforcement. So it looks like there's wind blowing through them. Got, of course, got to have the Jolly Roger at the very top. Can't have a pirate ship without that. That's a necessity. We got the steering wheel inside. We got the uh, seat back here from the steering wheel. And in the back, same thing. We got the windows that are all cut out. Let me go around the side. We got those windows. And the more cannons going down the side. We also got the actual rope ladders that are tied each one of those little knots all the way to the very top to the crow's nest, which is actually hollowed out. For uh, I can stick a little figure up there if I want. As we go towards the front of the ship, we also have the little silhouette of a lady. My handle in the front, this handle acts as two purposes. One, for me to pull it along, and two, it has the LED lights inside of it that light up the ship. They light up the front of the ship. And then at the very front, I have a button. Button, when you press this button, you go down, it actually runs little LEDs inside the cannons that kind of make it look like the cannons are actually firing. Just press it again, it shuts them off. Step back one more time, get a good view of it. Thanks for watching.